the career sharing from Miss Yuasakawa.
shows since I was very young. Oh, are you saying I'm not young? Oh, you are! I'm about the... Uh, how old do you think I am right now? I don't know, 50. <laughs>
sore throat or some things like that. But as a human being, we cannot avoid that. Yeah, sadly I'm not a vocaloid, so sometimes I catch a cold. Anyway, um, I didn't know, I have no idea. <laughs> So, um, because uh, when the uh, situation is unwell, right, um, the sound, the voice doesn't come out uh, very smooth. But um, to prevent this um, happens, because they, they knew that this would happen some days. So, they've been training every day to let them um, always in the situations that no matter how sick they are, how sore throat they are, they can complete the recording smoothly. So uh, if the situation really got uh, very bad, like uh, stuck in nose or the voice doesn't really come out, then um, she will tell the staff uh, earlier in advance. sounds very bad well um, they are not allowed to cancel on the day itself so um well um her body is uh, she knows well like i'm getting sick or what so um she must tell uh, the staff in advance so if released on the recording days she still can't able to make it so we'll leave it to the directors to decide that one to postpone or not but so far um this situations never happened. Um, they just keep on recording and cover it up with lots of other things. Okay. Thank you for the nice question. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah, that, that was a very interesting question. Mm -hmm. Very knowledgeable question. And uh, this uh, next question is from uh, is a Penang guy. Uh, his name is uh, his nickname is Tok Tok Me. I'm sure everyone wanted to know this. What made you truly enjoy what you do? Is it the passion? Would you say you choose the character to voice when they most fit your personality? Or they were offered for you? Sorry. 
chance, if we got a chance to be more popular, well known. And then for Nyuka, there are lots of uh, kind of kino. Nyuka, she can do more efficient, exciting thing. Yeah, so I'm so excited about it. Yeah, it's about to release. Yes. So, so, so those of you Vocaloid fans, Luca version 3 is coming out, the Advent version, okay? So check it out, it's on YouTube, okay? Wait for the uh, re re release, the new release, it's gonna come, yeah. right? Now, uh, there's a news, right? I'm sure, any, any Fate Stay Night fans over here?
this. Yeah. Uh, do you like Enka? Enka? No, I'm not. No, I don't. Enka? Enka? No. Okay. Here are uh, two animals, cat and dog. Which cat. one would you like? Cat, 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 cat. cat. Very hot. <laughs> right. It's very hot. Okay, 
so you like horror games? Yes, I do. You like horror games?
year. Who wants to know more about BSAU? So uh, there's this academy, the SAU Academy that's uh, that's going to be built in Malaysia. Ooh, yeah. Really? Yeah, right? Malaysia? The Kadokawa. Ka uh, the Kadokawa Content <gasps> Academy. Yeah. yeah. So um, are there any advice you want to give to some of the young inspirational SAUs over here? So the students want to be a seiyu in Japan? Yes. Oh uh, really? Okay, so... Uh, for them yeah, to for my advice, because uh, some of seiyus in Japan is from other country. We have Russian seiyu in Japan, she speaks uh, Japanese perfectly, and some of uh, the other seiyus from the other countries, but they are always struggling with Japanese, of course, because they... They are Japanese, their Japanese is uh, not first language. So if you want to be a seiyu in Japan using Japanese, uh, uh, it's of course better study Japanese very hard because we have a uh, really sometimes very difficult pronunciation in Japanese and uh, you you cannot have accent like a Malaysian accent in Japanese of course. So. So please learn how to act very much. And uh, if you want to be say in Japan, uh, of course Japanese is our uh, most priority part. Yeah, because uh, we say uh, say you has to be a professional for Japanese. So please study hard Japanese first, then acting. Voice, that's not enough. Please don't forget. So, number one, you need to get your Japanese up to scale, okay? Learn Japanese. Number two is learn how to act, right? Yeah. Because I'm sure uh, when you're doing the seiyu, you have to put your emotion, mm -hmm. right? Emotion when you are uh, screaming or you are mm -hmm. acting, mm -hmm. right? So yeah. I think, I think uh, how to show your emotion is, I think it's different between Japan have to learn about it because in the US Western people is like a really bright and outgoing type there so but in Japan uh, sometimes a kind of decency or quiet thing is kind of welcome in Japan so you have to learn how to show your emotion so um, this that was the that was one of the last questions, right? So thank you for answering all those questions. What? I know it's very hard. <laughs> Give her a round of applause because she's answering. <laughs> thank you. Those beautiful questions. Right. Okay. Um, now to just just so for everyone to relax uh, because we have some time. Uh, we would like to play a little game with you. Game. Yeah. Game. Okay. It's a little game. <laughs> it's a short game. This game is called uh, Cards Against Humanity. Cards <laughs> Against My Humanity. Okay. Yeah, Cards okay. Against Humanity. Have you heard of this game? No. No. Okay, it's very simple, okay? It's a Me, game. you, and uh, Nemo. Nemo. Okay? Each of us are going to get five cards. Mm -hmm. Okay? And then, uh, my friend, DK, he will give us, the, let's say, this one. Okay? So, it's like feeling the blanks. Something and me and Nino have to do 